Hello, trivia fans! Welcome to that soon-to-be-popular game show, Know-It-All Quiz Game, where you work with your teammates to answer some of the most difficult questions ever posed by anyone, anywhere! Today, we've got a really big shoe! Hey, Moose, who you think you are, Ed Solomon? Hey, mind your own beeswax. I am your host, Boo Winkle J. Moose. Boo Winkle, they already know who you are. Gee, Rock, it's in the script. When playing a quiz game, the contestants must first decide how difficult the questions will be. They can be easy or hard. To change the level of difficulty, click on the switch now. After determining a level of difficulty, each contestant must choose a team, an avatar as team captain, and two teammates. Hey, Rock, what's an avatar? Bullwinkle, didn't you pay attention at the production meeting? An avatar is someone that represents the contestants on the stage. Oh, yeah, must have forgot. Okay, click here to choose your team captains and teams now. Welcome to the green room. Here, you can choose a team captain and then pick a team. The teams are Frostbite Falls, Pottsylvania, and my own alma mater. What's the matter, you? Yay. Ooh, tough crowd. Okay, contestant number one, choose your team captain and team now, or click the question mark for a few tips. Here, you can choose your teammates and then click this here arrow to go back to the green room. Click the question mark for a few helpful hints. Frostbite Falls, choose your two teammates now. Nell Fenwick. Let me do right. It would be an honor to be on your team. Don't forget, before you choose another teammate, you gotta unchoose one that you already choosed. Uh, choose? Next contestant, choose your team captain and team now. If there are no other contestants, click over here. In this game, it's Frostbite Falls versus the champs from Botsylvania. Good luck, challenger! To begin the game, click here now. You're now on the team from Puzzlebee. You're now on the team from What's the Matter You? All contestants must have two teammates in order to play the game. Are you sure you want to return to the backstage area? Pottsylvania, choose your two teammates now. Dali. Natasha Fatal. We will crush the other teams, won't we? Boris Badenov. Next contestant. What's the matter, you? Choose your two teammates now. Holy smoke, I'd sure like to be on your team. Remember, you can lead a team in trivia, but you can't make it think. I think we'd make a great team. With our brains together, we may have a chance. Mr. Peabody! Rocket J. Squirrel! Oh, Rocky for short. Okay, me the best team win! To begin the game, click here now. Are we ready for some big time action? Yay! Hmm, somebody ought to check this audience for a pulse. 
In this round, the teams take turns answering questions by pressing A, B, or C on the keyboard. Uh, that means you. If that team gets it wrong, then anyone else can buzz in to answer. Remember your buzzer key. Frostbite Falls, your buzzer is the tab key. Pottsylvania, the buzzer for your team is the return key. What's the matter you? Your team's buzzer is the space bar. Today's questions will be read by that popular narrator, I... Mm, gee, I forgot your name. Well, say hello to the crowd, Mr. Narrator. Uh, thanks a lot. Well, it looks like our heroes, Rocky and Bullwinkle. Bullwinkle, the narrator thinks he's still on our old show. I think he may be having a memory problem. Don't be such a worrywart, Rock. He's just warming up. Uh, right, Mr. Narrator? Yes, that's right. Just warming up. Well, now that we're all set, on with the show! Let's choose the categories, shall we? Frostbite Falls, choose the first category. Okay, Pottsylvania, choose the second category. What's the matter you? Choose that third category. Okay, that last category will go wait for us in round two. The category is landmarks or big famous places. Here is a question for Frostbite Falls. In 1860, Fort Sumter near Charleston, South Carolina was the first battle site of which war? A. Civil War B. Spanish-American War or C. Revolutionary War If you know the answer, hit your buzzer key now! What's the matter, you? Half the points for what's the matter, you! Keep it up! We'll show them! Get ready for a question, Pottsylvania! What gift from France stands in New York Harbor? Is it A, the Montreal Clock Tower, B, Twin Towers, or C? Correct answer for Pottsylvania! We will have huge victory celebration when we win! This question is for what's the matter you? What would you find in Madame Tussauds Museum in London? A, modern art, B, toys and models, or C, wax models? Points for what's the matter you? Our chances of winning have never been better. Here is a question for Frostbite Falls. What is the name of the U.S. President's official office? A. The Oval Office. B. The... P Score for Frostbite Falls! Fair person, your skill is a joy to behold. Get ready for a question, Pottsylvania. The Vent Haven Museum of Ventriloquism is located in Kentucky. What would you expect to find there? A. Computers, B. Saddles, or C. Puppets. Oh, too bad, Pottsylvania. If you know the answer, hit your buzzer key now. Close, but not quite, what's the matter, you? The right answer is C. The category is health and the human body, or what makes us tick? This question is for what's the matter you? What biological system is the bladder a part of? A. Respiratory, B. Nervous, or C. Urinary? Nope. Sorry, what's the matter you? If you know the answer, hit your buzzer key now. The right answer is C!
<laughs> Here is a question for Frostbite Holes. What is the largest preventable cause of illness in the United States? A, a fatty diet. B, accidents in the kitchen. Or C, cigarette smoking. No score for Frostbite Fools. If you know the answer, hit your buzzer key now. <coughs> Half the points for what's the matter you. That's the way. Let them have it. Get ready for a question, Puzzlevania. What mineral is needed for strong bones? Is it A, calcium? Correct answer for Pottsylvania. <laughs> You're good enough to be a bad enough. This question is for what's the matter you? What is the aorta? A, main artery that carries blood away from the heart. B, vein that empties blood into the heart. Or C, instrument that measures blood pressure. Points for what's the matter you? It would appear that we may just win this game. Here is a question for Frostbite Holes. What is a prosthesis? A, a way to take someone's temperature. B, an artificial body part. Or C, a person who assists a doctor. No score for Frostbite Holes. <coughs> Half the points for what's the matter you? We can win this game! The category is Recent Happenings, or The Year's TV AD. Get ready for a question, Puzzlevania! What famous actress sang Happy Birthday to President John F. Kennedy? Was it A, Marilyn Monroe, B, Grace Kelly? Oh, too bad, Puzzlevania! Frostbite Bull scores half the points. Oh my, but you are good at this. This question is for what's the matter you? What U.S. president did John Hinckley attempt to assassinate? Was it A, Gerald Ford? Nope, sorry, what's the matter you? If you know... Frostbite Bull scores half the points. I will not rest until we have won! Here is a question for Frostbite Falls. Former Senator and Presidential Candidate Bob Dole came from what state? A. Kansas, B. Missouri, or C. Score for Frostbite Falls! Fear not! Our goodness shall prevail! Get ready for a question, Puzzlevania! IBM introduced its first personal computer in which year? A, 1969. B, Oh, too bad, Pottsylvania. <coughs> Frostbite Bull. Frostbite Bull scores half the points. Who oh, do keep up the good work? This question is for what's the matter you? In 1974, scientists reported which of these chemicals was destroying the ozone layer. Was it A, hydrogen dioxide, B, carbon dioxide, or C, chlorofluorocarbons? Points for what's the matter you? I believe we have the superior team. Okay, that's it for round one. What's the matter you is now in the lead. How about a hand for what's the matter you? Hmm, maybe they should try two hands next time. Hmm, must be time for a commercial break. Okay, welcome to round two. Yay. Where do they get these audiences anyway? In this round, the first team to press its buzzer key can try to answer the question. Contestants choose answers by pressing A, B, or C on the keyboard after they buzz in. 
If the wrong answer is given, the first team to press its buzzer key can then also try to answer. Director on the set! Hey, when do I get a break? You got it! Good thing it was a short break. The category for this round is famous people or folks everybody should know. What kind of stories did famous author Agatha Christie write? A. Romance, B. Mysteries and Thrillers, or C. Science Fiction? That's right, Frostbite Bulls! For what food is Orville Redenbacher famous? A. Popcorn, B. Chicken, or C. Soup? <laughs> Sorry, what's the matter, you? Anybody else? The correct answer is A. What famous aviator vanished while trying to fly around the world? A. Amelia Earhart. B. Charles Lindenberg. Or C. Harriet Quimby. <laughs> Sorry, what's the matter, you? Anybody else? The correct answer is A. What kind of television show does Oprah Winfrey host? A. Talk show. B. Sitcom. C. What's the matter? Sorry, what's the matter, you? Anybody else? The correct answer is A. What was Neil Armstrong the first astronaut to do? A. Walk on the moon. B. Fly in space. Or C. Design a space. That's right, Frostbite Fools! What profession made Julia Child famous? A. Modeling. B. Cooking. C. Nursing. Score for what's the matter you? What was fictional character Sherlock Holmes's profession? A. Security guard. B. Detective. Or C. That's right, Frostbite Fools! Who was the president of the Republic of Texas? Was it A, Sam Houston? Sorry, what's the matter, you? Anybody else? The correct answer is A. What was Civil War General Thomas J. Jackson's nickname? A, Stonewall. B. Sorry, what's the matter, you? Anybody else? The correct answer is A. And that's the end of round two. Hey, that's not in the script. Welcome to the third and final round! Well, it's about time! The third round consists of statements that may or may not be true. When a true statement is presented, the first team to press its buzzer key is awarded the points. Points are only awarded for identifying true statements. If a false statement is presented, the contestants should avoid pressing their buzzer keys at all costs. The statements will be from any of the categories we've seen in the first two rounds. Here we go! Betsy Ross was the first woman to be pictured on an American coin. That one's false, what's the matter, you? Henry David Thoreau wrote numerous novels and poems while he lived in the petrified forest. You are all right! The statement is false!
Tendons attach muscles to bones. Good call, what matter you? Interesting and effective. Nelson Mandela was the first black man elected president of Kenya. Bit one's false, what's the matter, you? Louis Braille invented sign language. Bit one's false, what's the matter, you? The Globe Theatre in London, England is famous for its Shakespeare productions. Correct, Frostbite Fools! This is so exciting. Churchill Downs is a factory where goose and duck feathers are stuffed into pillows. Bit one's false, what's the matter, you? Lady Diana Spencer married Charles, Prince of Wales, on July 29, 1981. Good call, what's the matter, you? You're doing good. In 1960, the American flag had 50 stars. Good call, what's the matter, you? Interesting and effective. U.S. President John Quincy Adams was no relation to U.S. President John Adams. That one's false, what's the matter, you? And that's the end of our game. Congratulations, Frostbite Bulls. You are the winners. Hello, contestants, and welcome to that hallowed hall that is dedicated to the Big Moose on campus. Or Big Meese, as the case may be. It is here that the top three contestants and scores are listed in all their glory. Congratulations, contestants. You are now a Big Moose on campus. Okay, audience, let's hear it for the Big Moose. Yeah. Hmm, think we need a new audience here. To take your rightful place in trivia history, type your name here now. Congratulations! <laughs> Welcome back, contestants! Seems kind of familiar, don't you think? Click here if you need some reminders. Hello, contestant. Oh, shucks. Do you really have to go? Oh, shucks. Do you really have to go? Okay, but here's some people we hope you really like. <laughs> 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 